This league seems to have run the numbers on exactly how much they can speak out about social issues, donate to social issues, even say the word social issues, while still maximizing profits. Whether fans cheer or boo, it's all just ones and zeros to the league. And that's why we sat down with a few fans to poll them on how they feel the NFL is doing with social progress. Is it possible for the NFL to please both its conservative fans and the fans who believe police brutality exists? To find out, we spoke to fans on the left. No, go. America, land of... Soul-crushing capitalism. <laughs> capitalism. <laughs> Disappointment. And the right. Defund the... People who are against the police, <laughs> but I don't know who they are. Planned Parenthood. Marxists. Defund everything that's one with the liberals. Luckily, my unassuming white friends, the Good Liars, prepared some new initiatives designed to please both sides. We want your honest feedback on it because we're hoping to pitch these to the NFL very, very soon. If you agree with them, you're gonna give an it's good signal. And if you don't, uh, you're gonna throw a flag on the play. So this would be called the NFL All Pronouns <laughs> Initiative. So during the starting lineup broadcast, players are required to say their names, their college, and their preferred gender pronouns. How do we feel about that? Okay, maybe you're not understanding. So who's your, who's your favorite player? Um, I'll just say Daniel Jones now. Daniel yeah. Jones. So it, it would go something like this. Daniel Jones, Duke, they, them. What's the point for doing that during a game? Just, just to find common ground. So this is woke on steroids, for God's sake. I'm sorry, you didn't bring the buckets. Can we just like, I need a vomit bucket. Ma'am, we don't have that. Let's try the other room. So this is a new rule where all the players would be required to stand for the national anthem at the beginning of the game. And <laughs> let me finish. <laughs> and it would be called Stand Your Ground. You took the black fist and then you're like, yeah, but this is for white people now. It's the Elvis of slogans. <laughs> but you do like the name. No. No. Oh, no. We don't no, like no, no, anything no, no, no. about it. No. Yeah, no. Very no. trash. Because it pulled through the roof with conservatives. So, of course well, it did. Yeah. What if you still have to stand for the national anthem? But after the anthem plays, everyone has to remain standing for a different song. Like, I don't know, Meek Mill's Dreams and Nightmares. I used to pray for times like this, to rhyme like this. Mmm. So I had to grind like that to shine like this. All right, I'll meet you at a place where uh, it's regional. So in Atlanta, mm. it's an outcast or a okay. mob song. Okay, but uh, but there is there is middle ground here. I, no, this is this sucks. <laughs> yeah, I, just okay. don't agree. I, I don't That's agree not with I it. Damn, is there anything we can all agree on? Through uh, the Inspire Change Initiative, the NFL's donating $25 million a year. What if we upped that number? Is there a number at which you would stop watching? No, <laughs> I don't give as much as they want. It can be as much as they want, yeah. 100 million is fine, yeah. They got plenty of money. I thought she was gonna throw up again. So both groups are cool with spending more? How much more? How much money would the NFL have to spend per year for you to say, okay, you guys are actually doing something. I'm gonna watch football all the time. I wanted to know how much they made. $17.1 billion a year. Right, if revenue. they gave, um, is 25% too, too much? 4.2 billion. I would like 9 billion. Before you laugh at him, what's more absurd? Donating about half your revenue to social justice or 0.15%? I seen better numbers from the pullout method. 8.55 billion mm -hmm. is half, and everyone would give that. I, I would give sign. them my money if they did that, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Specifically, if the NFL put 8.55 billion dollars into the Inspire Change program, would you keep watching? Yeah. Is there everybody's touchdown? <laughs> it almost seems like no matter what the NFL does, people are probably gonna gonna keep watching. Yes. Yeah. There are things I'm going to disagree with, but like I'm a sports fan, I feel like that I'll still watch sports. We all know what we're doing when we turn on the TV. We know we're like strapping up for this narcotic. We know what we're doing. We're all, we're all complicit. You know what? That's a slogan all fans would agree with. The 
NFL. We're all complicit.